G'day, I'm Craig and this is my camping channel. Today I'm going to be installing some storage solutions into the camper van um, to cover cups, wine glasses, kitchen sponges and brushes, paper towels, and I'm going to chuck a clock in. I had most of this stuff shipped to me from AliExpress in China to me here in Auckland, New Zealand. So I received a holder for wine glasses and that comes with um, hooks as well which may be able to hold cups um, and I'll try that out. I've got a paper towel holder and the fixings to go on the wall so we'll attach that these little holders attach inside the sink the 3M product here and we'll see if they can hold our sponges and cleaning products. I'm going to mount this clock because there's a uh, grate that's been installed and I want to hide it and it's a lovely clock and it's nice to have a clock in the kitchen. I'm putting the clock in first. This grate was installed when I had a solar panel fitted to the roof it was actually put in by error by the installer and it serves no purpose other than annoy me. So I thought the clock could just cover up over the top of it and it's far more attractive and it's nice to have a clock in the camper. So I'm just going to work out exactly where to fit it. I've taken the base of the clock off just to help me mark the right space. Just pre-drill. <laughs> Fix the screw here. Secure. I'm going to stick this Velcro onto the back of the clock to hold its position. Lightly attach this one. And then press it firm. That should hold us while we're moving. Take this off. Okay, the base is, base is back on the clock. Slide on the top. And... That feels pretty firm. Time will tell. Okay, moving on. Clock is covering the grate. I'm going to fit the paper towel holder about here. I sort of want it sort of matching the baking tray I fixed down here for the magnetic um, spice holders. 
um, if you're interested. This is a picture by Lester Hall. I used to drink with him a lot in the 80s, so I thought it'd be nice to have one of his pieces of art to go with me. It has an adhesive backing, so I'm going to stick that on first. That's actually quite strong, and paper towel is very light. I'm tempted to leave it without attaching the screws. Well, I've had a look at the fittings for the towel rail, and I quite like the little fake brass cover. The screws would be okay, a little long, and this is for jib board or dry board or plaster board, so it's the wrong fitting. I think for now, I'm just going to leave it with the adhesive. So if it falls off, screws will come. I'm mounting the wine glass holder. I'm just trying to find a spot I can get at. Mark a couple of marks. Okay, the um, holder for the wine glasses is down the store. I bought these wine glasses from Hunting and Fishing. They're meant to be unbreakable, but because of the stem and size, they're quite hard to store, so this should make it a lot better. So I don't have to worry about them banging into each other. It should be fine. I also got these little hooks that came with them. So in theory, it would be possible to hook a cup off it. But I'm not 100% sure. It's holding the cup. But you certainly wouldn't travel with it like this. On the plus side, it gets two cups out of the way as well. It just doesn't feel that secure. We'll see how we go. So I'm going to fit these into the um, kitchen sink. And as I said earlier, they will be storing sponges and brushes. So. They come with adhesive backings, so I'm just going to try and fix that. And I think they'll go into the sink like so. Put the first one there and the second one about here. There that's one in. I always have my doubts about these double sided tape things. They always fail and let you down. Okay, sponge, brush. Well, they're both out of the way now. So we installed the um, holders for the sponge and brush. Okay, and we've got the 
wine glasses and the little holder, nice and secure. Paper towels now and they're on their holder, quite nice and out of the way. And we've got the clock hiding that grate. So that's it for today. A few storage ideas and it all fitted in quite nicely. Thanks for being here. Bye for now.